The job of our immune system is to fight pathogens that cause sickness. The immune system is made from white blood cells, and there are several different types that each do specific jobs. Some white blood cells have the job of recognizing pathogens. Other white blood cells produce antibodies, and some white blood cells are designed to engulf pathogens. Let's see how this all works. The immune system is triggered by foreign molecules called antigens. Antigens are found on the surfaces of pathogens like viruses. The presence of a pathogen is detected when white blood cells recognize a specific foreign antigen. Now that the pathogen has been detected, special white blood cells need to produce molecules called antibodies to flag the pathogen. Antibodies are custom built with a specific shape that matches the antigens detected, just like a lock and key. But making the right antibody takes time. During this time, the pathogen is able to replicate, invade cells, and cause sickness. But eventually, the correct antibodies are built and mass-produced by the white blood cells. The antibodies stick to the antigens of the pathogens. The shape is custom-made to match. Flagged pathogens can no longer get into host cells. The antibody flag is a signal that marks the pathogen for destruction. Antibodies can tag multiple pathogens and cause them to clump up. These pathogens are then engulfed and destroyed by other specialized white blood cells. The first time you encounter a pathogen, antibody production takes time. But if the same pathogen enters the body again, there is no delay. The white blood cells remember how to make the specific antibody needed. Millions of antibodies are produced immediately, giving the pathogen no chance to replicate or infect cells. The ability to produce specific antibodies is what makes you immune to a certain pathogen.